It's finally done. That's right, I've done it. I've organized my staff. It only took 70 episodes, but I finally got around to doing it. Each exhibit has a keeper, and I put in a bigger staff room over here, and a bigger zookeeper hut, and some of these other exhibits have zookeeper huts right next to them, so it's even faster, and it's done. And hooray, that's finally done. You don't have to yell at me anymore. Also, I went around and put some of the... Enrichment. That's what it's called. It's literally right on my screen. I put some enrichment in with some of the exhibits. Uh, we haven't researched the elephants yet and something else, but some of the stuff overlaps. So we were able to get some crap in there. And uh, yeah, I was about to name the elephants. So here I am scrolling through my comments on my video and I'm looking at the sidebar on YouTube and it's just a bunch of weird live streams. And they all have like 2,000 people watching them. Playing the Chrome Dinosaur game. Okay. There's another playing the Chrome Dinosaur game for a year. 2.7k views. Someone doing Minecraft. 600 views. Another Minecraft. One like equals one speed. Digging in a straight line in Minecraft. 3.3 thousand people are watching that. Minecraft 1.16. Any percent speedrun attempts. 900 people watching that. Playing Temple Run, but every like makes it faster. 3.8k? What is happening here? Mr. Joe Police Parking Frenzy 2.0 Taxi 3D Bus Driving? 2.2k? Driving by bus for one year, but every like makes it faster. One point- What the hell is with all these live streams popping up on the side of my video? Breaking every- Breaking Bedrock in Minecraft, but every like make it fat Make it faster. Two, is that what I need to do? Is that what I need to- Okay, Planet Zoo, um- Adding animals, every like, doesn't change the speed because I can't do that. Minecraft in real life. Minecraft in real life 2020. 2,000 people. Is that what I need to do? Do I need to make a stream? <laughs> like that. They just look like really scammy freaking streams. It's so weird. I don't know why they're popping up on my video. Anyway, that's not important. What is important is the names of the elephants. I love how I've wasted... Two, three minutes doing that. Um, the number one liked comment here. Name the elephants Diana and Hole to show you don't care if they die in a hole, the pit. Diana Hole. So, naturally, we'll name the female Hole. <laughs> Not saying it. And the male will be named Diana. You know, the joke there was the male got the name Diana, which is typically a female name, but there's an even worse joke that could be made there that I ain't making, but, you know, props if you caught it. Anyway, uh, another comment said, you know, I should put the gate of the thing down and then have the ramp coming out of the exhibit, not in the exhibit, which, you know, would be smart. So I'll probably do that from here on out. I don't think we have to worry about the elephants getting up there because they're too fat, so I can't. I don't see them breaking out. They might, which could be fun, but I don't think we're going to worry about that. Anyway, these idiots are complaining that they can't see the elephants. So you know what we're going to do? We're going to make them see the elephants by doing this. We're going to get a fat path. I don't know if this will work, but we're going to try. It will work. Good. And we're just going to throw this directly over the elephant exhibit. I do not care. There you go. You want to see the elephants? You can see the elephants now, you freaking idiots. Oh, look, the elephants are too far away. Dude, they're the size of a planet. You can't see them from there? Jeez, I thought my eyes were bad. I know my eyes are bad, and I can see them. I'm, like, so much further away from them than you are, and I can see them just fine. I'm just throwing these everywhere just to try to milk them for, mo for money. Also, do you see how much money we have? At the end of the last video, we had 125000 I spent close to 20000 hiring staff and buildings and everything. Also, I set all my, or I made all my staff train, which is kind of cool. That's a thing that I completely forgot we could do. Um, staff, see, look, training, which means I think I have to pay them more money. Staff members already scheduled train, do so the next time they rest in the staff. Oh, that's how it's done. Okay. I did hire some more vendors because we had just the exact amount of vendors we need. I'm thinking about adding more food places in because I know we'll never be able to fight this completely and that the guests will always be freaking starving and thirsty, but 
you know, maybe I can get some more money from them if I put in another exhibit. I also need education. I'm aware these guys are stupid, so we need to make them not as stupid. First things first, let's see if we are making a profit here. $280. That's not a lot. I feel like I could inflate the prices and uh, get more money. But I'm not going to because I'm too lazy. We're already charging them for the bathroom, which honestly feels pretty good. <laughs> so we'll throw some more food down here, I guess. And uh, hope for the best. So let's do that. Maybe. Just maybe. Ooh. This is what we're doing this video. We're getting exhibit creatures because I know I can sell them for a lot of money. Um... Yeah, look, this freaking high workload garbage. Um, crap, 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 crap. What was I gonna do? This, research. Okay, this dude is researching barriers still. Well, we're gonna have the other dude... I don't think we have another place. Never mind. I was gonna have them research food shops next. I don't know, I just feel like we should have more than just the two food shops they give us. Maybe just a couple more. I don't know. Oh, well, who cares? We'll get another gulpy. And another chief beef. Come on, give me the good one. It wasn't the mmm tasty. I'm disappointed. Uh, let's also get a crapper. It'll be a double crapper. See, look, they instantly run up to the freaking thing. Actually, you know what? I lied. We're just gonna move this whole thing back. Back, 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 back. That way. They can have a much longer line and people aren't crowding on the path. Yes! Mmm, tasty! <laughs> I love it. Okay. Put that there. Habitat. Not what I wanted. Also, get that out of there. I want. Crapper. An extra large crapper, because it's two crappers. But we should be making 50 cents a piece. Good. Okay, what? Where'd the people go? Oh, stupid vendors. I bet you other vendors are taking over. We're gonna need another staff room back here. Anyway, we need don't feed the- oh my god, my elephant's no longer with us. Ah, oh, no, it's breathing. It's fine. Oh my god, those poops are humongous. Anyway, we need a don't feed the animal sign because these people are stupid and they'll try to feed the animals because they're stupid. I wish I could catch them feeding the animals and then feed them to the animals. That's what I would love to do. That would honestly make my day. We need a game like that. Where you can actually feed your guests to the animals if they disappoint you in any way. Don't feed the elephants, you freaking turds. Yeah, good enough. Okay, maybe we'll get a garbage can up here too. I can see them being stupid about it. No recycling cans because they cost 10 more dollars and I'm trying to save money here. Jeez. Okay. The crocodiles are banging all the time. I think the elephant's pregnant and I'm pretty sure a flamingo has also given birth. It's really hard to keep up with everything. Also, I put a sprinkler directly in the path. These people are complaining that they're hot. Well, guess what? I can do with a... Wait, this zoo can do with a... I'm working my freaking hardest to make this place an actual zoo and they're bitching about the size being too small. I hate I why do why did Frontier make their guests so hateable? That's what I want to know. Every single negative thought. There isn't much to see in the zoo. I literally I'm working on it. There's much to see in the zoo. I'm gonna need refreshments soon, it's so hot. Maybe I'll come back to soda too when it's less busy. Well maybe if they made the guests not freaking thirsty every two seconds, that wouldn't be an issue either. I thought I just saw something rocket across my screen here. Time to leave, I think. It was good while it lasted. Time to go home. How long were they in this park for? I don't even know. Apparently they visited everything, so whatever. Uh, let's get some ATMs. Because I want more money. Can we put a crazy high um, fee on these things? That'd be terrific. I would love that. Shouldn't that be? I saw them somewhere. you think it would be somewhere around there, right? It's not. I don't know what it falls under, but the $250 a piece? Jeez. Oh, they go right up against the pa That's annoying. 
Okay. I'll just put it there. I just wanted them away. Like, I don't want them to clog up the main path. That's what I'm trying to avoid as much as possible. There you go. Okay, so what are we... This is ridiculous. I'm sorry, but this is absolutely ridiculous. What are we doing in this video? I should probably get more garbage cans down here. We're making a place for snakes and what have you. Let's see. What should I buy? I know frogs are pretty good for this. Frogs sure do love to bang. So, I think that's probably what we're going to go with. Someone said snakes, I think. Also, people have been saying red pandas. We'll put red pandas in next episode. This episode's going to be for uh, exhibit creatures. They're all pretty cheap. Are snakes known to bang a lot? What about beetles? I feel like the beetles would bang a lot. Spiders, definitely. Hmm. Should we go with those? There's some lizards. I think we were I think we're gonna go frogs. I know for a frat I know for a fract. Frogs like the bang. Um we'll hire I guess these two. Adopt. Actually no, we'll get all three. Wow. I can't believe how well that menu worked. It was like I wasn't even trying. These guys also bang a lot. I can't believe that was that was literally one click, one click, one click. I didn't have to click a billion times. Wow, it's like a whole new game. Anyway, uh, we'll have a reptile area, yes, our uh, exhibit area. I don't know. We'll throw the path down this way. And I guess we'll throw whatever this is over here. So we'll have a smaller path. I don't know how this is going to work. I'm just kind of winging this right now. I know, you know, reptile houses are a thing. This isn't going to be a house. This is going to be a freaking... Oh my god, I hate the path so much. It's essentially just going to be a mess. That's what it is. It's going to be a reptile mess. Let's see. Habitat. Do they fall under habitat or where are they? Not they are facilities, I think. Small animal exhibits. There we go. So this one has, are they actually in it? Oh, this is a large one. Look at this. It's almost like they knew exactly what I wanted here. Did that work? Did I just make this perfectly? Oh my god, I did. Warthogs matured, hooray. So we can get freaking so many fricks in this frick. When I say so many fricks, I mean eight. Well, that's still pretty good. It's perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. And we can put them along the side, too. Look at that. Um, we're going to make sure we get these things over here. I don't know if this is how they work. But I'm doing it anyway. Crap. You can only put them on, like, one side. I don't know. They should be able to reach it, right? Oh, boy. Things about to have offspring. We gotta do something about that. Their exhibits are gonna get full because of all the babies they're having. Okay. Animal trading. Set all filters. We don't need any more freaking elephants. I'm still... I'm losing money. What the... I don't like losing money. This place is all about making money. Do I have any rewards? Oh, yeah. Uh, boy. Sure, I'm glad I have that as a reward. A sable antelope. It's a pretty good sable antelope. But sable antelopes are actual trash. Like, they are a trash animal. <laughs> hey, I think we finished the research there. Good. Oh, look at that. They're two stars now. Okay, you clowns go to... Let's get different foods. I would have another one do work, but we don't have another place, so... Oh, well. Vet research is also complete. Okay, they're working on the elephants. Good. Um, where the hell are my... Here it is. It helps when you press the right button. So look at this. I was able to shift-click them all, which was really nice. Send to zoo. Poison frogs. Scheduled for delivery. The keeper cannot reach the exhibit due to your work zone. I think we need to hire a free-roaming keeper. 
Bef until we set up everything here, we need a free roaming keeper. There you go. Enjoy your job as frogs. That's it. It's your only job. Okay. Wait a second. Oh, no. We can only have four. Damn. Actually, no. This is going to work out better. I guess. Oh, no. They're not in humidity range. Freaking give me a second. Jeez, they literally just got put in there. No power. That could be a problem. Jeez, they like it freaking hot. That's the truth. They can have 50. Okay, and they need they need power or they will die. Um, facilities. Um, crap, 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 crap. Power, 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 power. Transformer. It's like that movie with the robots. Do you guess hate the way these things look? Probably. Also, why is it not snapping to the path at all? There it goes. Honestly, I don't care if guests think they're ugly. They're going to deal with it. Okay. Fragos. You better be happy. I can not even see the speed up button. My microphone's in the way. Increasing. I, I wish I had a better setup here, but I can't. My desk is the worst. My desk absolutely sucks. It's small. I have my monitor right here. I have my second monitor over here. It's not even on the desk. It's on a filing cabinet. I was lucky enough to have it at the same exact height as the desk. And then my computer's over here because my computer's too big to go on the ground underneath the desk. So, this desk is small. In the front here, there's this stupid lip. Um, which I guess it's nice because if I'm back out here, I can just grab it and pull myself in. So that's all right. But next to that, there's these drawers attached to it. The sides of the desks are rounded, and that's where the, the legs are. It's just like a piece going across. And then the only spot I could put my mic arm was the back, and it's far away. So it's stretched out completely. It's over my mouse, which is why I'm always hitting the damn thing. And it just gets in the way of my screen. Hi. Welcome to Planet Zoo, where I complain not only about the game, but about literally everything. <laughs> oh, damn, that was fast. So they want... Oh. Oh, that's my bad. I increased the temperature, not the humidity. I'm literally boiling them alive. <laughs> they wanted... So they were happy at 30 degrees C, and I upped it all the way to 50. Poor, poor dudes. Is that where you want it? There you go. You better be, better be giving me money. Oh, my God. Wait a second. Damn it. I missed who it was. Hold on. We're going to be able to kick some people out here. Go ahead. Do it. Drop it on the ground. Drop it on the ground. I dare you. I freaking dare you. They've, they're double fist in their trash. They're looking at... The, I think they still have the trash, right? They better still have the trash. Wait. Their hands are empty. I didn't see them throw it on the ground, but it's gone. I wonder if it's in that trash pile. Okay. Go ahead. I just need I need 100% evidence here. I can't just kick them out on a whim. I mean, I can. They're, it's just disappearing. They're not actually throwing it on the ground. It's just vanishing. Like, it's just no longer in their hands. When they go up to this thing, they just it just disappears. I am seeing a lot of trash here. Oh, here we go. Go ahead. Go ahead, do it. Do it. I dare you. I freaking dare you. They might actually make it to a garbage can. I love how our freaking janitor's in the way. They're going to make it, aren't they? They know I'm watching, that's why. Look at this freaking guy eating his hamburger and drink. Okay, we need crap down here to stop people from throwing crap on the ground because uh, the people in this game are terrible. And even if there isn't a garbage can nearby, the, their first instinct is just to drop it on the ground. That's a problem. I'm sorry, that's a problem. It's called finding a garbage can, you lazy SOBs. Quit being lazy SOBs and find a garbage can. 
Just because you're not immediately next to one doesn't mean you can't hold your trash for five seconds until you find one. Lazy SOBs. Okay, benches. Do we have any benches in this? We don't. We don't have a single bench. Good, we don't need them. Actually, I think we do. Damn it. I don't even know where the benches are. It's probably under something. Facilities? Benches? There we go. So you know they're going to be freaking idiots and want to sit down. We really don't have any spots for benches. I don't want to block the views too much. I don't think the crocodiles could swim. I've never seen them step foot in this. And someone did say that, you know, it was a little too shallow. I think they were right. Because I have not seen a single crocodile swimming. Which is kind of funny. Okay. Damn, I cannot believe how many people are looking at these things. Is this thing making any money? It is. Nice. Are they happy? Welfare. Exhibit. The layout. Ooh. What do they want better for layout? Oh, I need to... Right. I need to research them first. Okay. Whatever you're doing, stop doing it and research these frogs. This is more important. Vet research. Hurry it up. I don't care about the elephants. The elephants don't matter at all anymore. Keith... I know your name's Bauer, but I'm gonna call you Blower. Keith Blower. Research those damn frogs. Also, can I upgrade my staff some more? I mean, we have so much money now. I'd be willing to spend more money to make them better. Ah, big brain plays. I can do it. $35. I hope their money goes up automatically. I mean, they're all happy, so I'm assuming it is. Yeah, damn, we're paying them so much more. That's not worth it at all. That's literally not worth it. It'll perform better. I better make them move faster. God, I'm paying them so much money. The vendors are who we really need to work on here because they are apparently really bad at their job. Or the game is just programmed in a way so they look terrible at their job. So we did it, everyone. We got some froggos in. Should we get more froggos? I think we should get more froggos. I can't find these froggos. I think we're going to get the golden poisonous ones because I know. I know those ones love to do it. And uh, you can have like 5 billion of them in your exhibit. And they're fine with that. So, let's do that. And then maybe we'll get spiders or snakes or I don't know. Next episode though will be those other things. Damn it. There's no females. Hey, we finally got one after 200 years. Sweet. So we'll throw those into this thing real quick and then call it a friggin' day. I honestly, I wish there was more females there, but you know, what are you gonna do? Nothing you can do. They absolutely hate their place. What do they need? Less temperature. What do they need? More humidity. Sorry, this up. I got things to do. Good. All right, and with that, what the hell did I just do? With that, I'm gonna end this one here. We have more frogs to research. We'll worry about that next episode. Um, next episode, we'll also add those red little idiots, also known as red pandas. They're great. And uh, yeah, I think that's it. I don't know if I'm gonna bother naming these frogs because you know, oh, it's gonna be an absolute nightmare. There's so many of them. Or there will be so many of them in the future. Look at this freaking guy. Honestly, they're so adorable. But yeah, it's probably why I won't be doing too much of that naming. I don't know. It's getting to a part where, you know, the animals are going to be more and more difficult to name. We're going to get more and more of them. Flamingos should be banging like crazy. Warthogs are definitely banging like crazy. I'm not going to be able to stay on top of naming all these things. So I guess just the big important things will get named. Like the elephants and things like that. But tiny stuff... Like, the red pandas will have names, but these frogs are not going to get named, and, you know, we'll see how it goes. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Leave a like and share the video if you enjoyed. That helped a lot. Subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you next time.